Hello and welcome to this new course in which you are going to learn I square C or I2C communication protocol in Arduino and how to use it effectively to communicate between two Arduino boards or between Arduino and other modules that support I square C. This is educational engineering team. Now what you will learn in this course. Since this course talks about I square C, we will learn about this great serial communication protocol, which is called I square C. And we are going to talk about how this type of communication protocol works, how many wires it needs, and what is the difference between this communication protocol and other communication protocol? I square C communication is generally used to communicate with gyroscope, accelerometer, barometric pressure sensor, LED display, seven segment display, and others. So, you will also learn how to communicate it with uh, some ICs or modules, and you will take a practical example. You will learn where to use I square C communication and when it's effective to use it and when you shouldn't use it. So we are going to cover all of these areas. Then we'll talk about I square C programming in Arduino. This is <clears throat> a very simple step and a very easy to do step. We are going to show you exactly where to connect I square C. Uh, enabled modules and how many wires it requires for Arduino to communicate using I square C with other Arduinos or other modules. So, and after connecting the right wires, we are going to show you how to program your Arduino so that it can be read and receive, uh, send and receive data via the I square C module. And we will use a quick example of how to connect two Arduino boards and to send data to and from these boards. Then we will take a more advanced example, which is how to read time, date, and other type of data from uh, the very famous time IC, which is called DS1307. It's uh, an IC that people use when they want to make clock using a microcontroller and we are going to interface it using I square C. I'm sure that you will enjoy this course content. After this course, you will be able to use I square C communication in any application and you will learn how to use it effectively, how to connect anything to Arduino and read data from that thing or that module using I square C and you will learn where to use I square C and where not to use I square C because you can't use it everywhere. You have to meet certain specifications, but for the most you will use it in any serial communication uh, project that you have because it only requires two wires. So it will make your life away much easier. Thanks for watching this quick introduction. If you have any question, you can ask it in the Q&A board or send us a message. I'll be more than happy to address your concern before joining the course. That's it. This is Ashraf from Educational Engineering Team.